Hello, hello, this is Arcades, and welcome to another Spotlight episode here on Stormworks Build and Rescue. And, uh, yeah. So, what do we have for here for today? Well, as you see, I'm in a room. A room full of supplies. Some dangerous. Some for saving lives. And, uh, got a bed. So, what is this? Wow, it's a nifty little vehicle I found. That seems to have a lot of purpose built into it. Alright, so what this is, is the T12 Shaba Multifunctional Truck. And uh, as you can see, it's like it's a uh, 8x8, 4x4? No, 8x8 drive truck. Uh, has a lot of options on it they can use. Right now I'm showing off uh, just one of them. Carrying a lot of random stuff back there. <laughs> You got a nice little interior in here. It's not fully decorated, but the the uh, creator said, uh, yeah, that's something they're really good at, which is fine. It's got a lot of purpose, and I can, uh, I can relate to that. So, without further ado, let's take a closer look at this. So, hope you like what you watch. Hope you enjoy what you see. If you do, remember to like, subscribe, and uh, leave a comment. Tell me what you think. And, uh, yeah, let's get into this. All right, all right, all right. So, this truck, uh, it's actually not bad. I like it so far. Uh, it's pretty easy to use overall. Because when you get in, it's in this state. And you just turn on the engine here. Gets a little screen. Hit your instruments. Hit your interiors. And you can see plenty. Supposedly, it says it's supposed to have a SeaWiz system on it. Uh, you have a little radar up there. Little uh, other options here we will take care of. We have, let's see, uh, one is the brake, A and D, for the driving control. It's pretty straightforward. <laughs> Apparently doesn't like, uh... But let's get it out in the light so you can see it better. So, we have... Like I said, we have the truck here. Uh... We got a container on there. It's meant to hold random junk, which is fine. You know, you can put it in there. Uh, we got plenty of antenna, obviously, for different things. Now, for the actual performance... Let's see, we got... Brakes, of course. Horn works. Then we have something called AWS. I believe that is all wheel steering. Right now, as it stands, just the front wheels. Three. Oh, there you go. Rear wheel steer. Then it says crab walk. All the wheels turn. So, we can move sideways. I mean, it's not bad. It actually gets some decent speed. And, as last thing, let's turn off the AWS. And it says, disconnect trailer. And there it goes. Which, it's not going anywhere, so it rehooks. <laughs> uh, it has a, a remote control function. Which, uh, I'm not exactly sure how to enable. I want to say it probably involves this. So let's go channel five. And I have the remote control here. Uh, I'm holding W. But nothing's really happening. I 
I'm probably doing something wrong. Oh well. We tried it. <laughs> I mean, it comes with it in the seat right there. So. But I don't see any explanations on how to use it. So. Uh, yeah. So why don't we take a look at its options. So the Crater came up has a whole number of different equipment you can install onto the back of it. Like I said, this is just one of them. Stores the junk, has some construction equipment, it says. As you can see, I went ahead and spawned out each truck with each of them attached so you can get a little, see what it looks like. Uh, so we got some hose stuff. Got the fuel there. We got water. Oh, he's even got them decently color coded too. Winch system. Uh, what do we have here? Is that a what the? F Why is there a? Is that a working generator? <laughs> I haven't looked completely what was on here, so this is kind of surprising. I'm like, what the F? I think it is supposed to be a generator that feeds off the fuel line of the truck. That's the way it looks. I can't get it flipped over because I think there's a start button at the side. Yeah, there it is. Okay, so yeah, and we filled up. And I guess it runs till it runs out of fuel. Okay. Uh so there is that. This is a little bag of stuff I was not expecting. What do we got here? I think this is just a light. Uh, what else we have here? A pump system? Oh! Oh! Oh, okay. I think I get it. Hold on. I think I get it. So, one of the, uh, things you get is a, um, is a crane. I think you could essentially hook the crane to use the crane to pick this stuff up and do what you need to with all this extra stuff. Door. <sighs> Ooh, nice. I don't have to pick it up. Lights galore. Yeah, lights, okay. Ah, look at this. Plenty of hoses, plenty of... Okay, at first I thought this was like a random junk carrier. Ah, there's a little hose splitter. Little radio unit. So you can yell at people. It's got an antenna. Uh, hand crank? I guess emergency generator. Yeah, that, that's what it looks like. Oh, let's see what it gets to. Not a lot. And yeah, last but least that, yeah, there's the pump. Okay, so I thought it was random junk to look like it was filling. No, it's actually a stuff with purpose. And then you have a whole bunch of, uh, yeah. Cables, a few hoses. So you can get everything working. Alright, alright, alright. I like it, I like it. Um. You can shut up.
Okay, so what do we got next on the list here? Uh, we have a trailer, actually. Trailer for a, You can fit a container on the back here as well, by the way. But they have a trailer so you can put two more containers onto it. As you can see, I spawned the trailer with two dummy containers. And it's just sitting there. Then we also have a mine car version. Or mining variant uh, option. Uh, what do we have here? Okay, the funnel's open, so that operates the funnel. And I mean, it's straightforward. It's just, uh, it's just, it looks like it's just a receiver. Uh, yeah, because I'm not seeing a drill of any sort, so looks like we just got a hopper for the thing, and you can use this to uh, empty it out. So transport truck. And then we got a fluid tanker uh, with three tanks to it. So you can put, you know, oil, diesel, jet, or oil, 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 diesel, 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 or any of their combination thereof, it looks like. Comes with plenty of hoses. Uh, oh yeah, that's the winch part of the truck. 32,000 liters, I assume, by that. And yeah, okay, that's not bad. Thirty-two thousand isn't something to scoff at. Oh, here's the crane truck, by the way. Ah, uh, okay. So we got a hose connector there. We got that. We got rope, and then we got the actual winch here. I don't think it's really meant for transferring anything. So let's see, crane operator. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Maybe this isn't for the truck, but instead for the stuff behind. Hold on, hold on. Okay. Let me, let me, uh, let me see this. I'm assuming it's still the truck, to be honest, but... No, handbrake on. Uh, yeah, no, stuff's not happening. Okay, never mind. I thought maybe. Magnet, yeah. It says slight in and out for the... Okay. Yeah. So, it seems like a basic enough little cranes thing. Uh, this is a container hauler. Kind of awkward with the hanging blocks. Supposedly you can go grab a container with this and set it in. Yeah, I didn't grab a uh, container for that. Uh, maybe I'll try it out in a moment. And then we have, last but not least... We have a passenger rescue. That's a bit of an elevator. And I don't get what's up with these antenna. I know they're antenna, but. And as seats in here, you get lights. Uh, basically, random assortment of stuff you could probably do in your magnet. And stick stuff down. So, yeah, it's, uh, not bad. I like the aesthetic. They got the fans up here acting like, look well, fans. Oh, wait, what? Oh, good. <laughs> it's like it locked me in here. We got doors on the side.
Now it said there was like a close in weapon system. I see we got the flares and all that, but yeah. Alright, uh, let's take this for a quick run and let's see if we can pick up one of the containers over uh, here. Alright, we're just going to start stop here. Yeah, we're hugging it, but you know what? Don't know how good or bad the uh, reach is on this thing. Uh, yeah, that's the water pump. Uh, extend. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Well, I mean, it's in there. I thought it was going to, like, connect one more time, but I guess not. Nope, I guess not. Okay. Well, yeah, so, I mean, that's pretty straightforward. <laughs> so, yeah, it's got a nice bit of options. Uh, this is a bit of a quickie. So, uh, I just wish I could figure out how to get the, um, remote control to work. Well, anyways, uh, oh yeah, look, backup camera. So, I guess I'm just gonna leave it off here. This is, as I said, this is the T12 Sheba Multifunctional Truck. And, uh, yeah, I thought it was, uh, pretty fun overall. It's a nice little package of options here. Between the uh, passenger, I guess, rescue container, the crane truck, the crane option, the uh, fluid container, the mining car, and finally the trailer, carry more containers, and the uh, <laughs> construction kit, which I threw everywhere. <laughs> Alright, so I hope you enjoyed what you watch. I hope you like what you saw. You know the deal. You know the spiel. Uh, <laughs> this is Arcades signing out. Have yourself a good day.